It's San Diego Hunger Awareness Month, so Mission Valley, excuse me, Mission Federal Credit Union and the San Diego Food Bank are partnering to provide much needed supplies for students around the county. Here to talk more about it, to my right is Courtney Pendleton from the Mission Vet Federal and Chris Carter, or no, Chris Carter's not here. Uh, <laughs> Stephanie Bunce. Stephanie Bunce. I'm tagging in. Yeah, Ste <laughs> Stephanie, for, you, for, you represent San Diego Food yes. Bank. All right, mm -hmm. I'm going to work to you in just a second. Okay. Tell us what's going on. Sure. So, uh, Mission Fed and the San Diego Food Bank have partnered on this amazing campaign for probably about a decade now. And it's called the Food for Kids Backpack Program. Okay. Why is it so important? Why? There are kids in our community who get free meals at schools, and then they may not eat over the weekend. And this is a serious problem in our community and so many things that people don't know about, but teachers and schools will identify the, these kiddos for the food bank, and we help, uh, we're one of the many who help fund this campaign for the food bank to be able to provide these backpacks for kids so they have food over the weekend. All right, so you're doing a tremendous service for the community. How big a problem is it? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a great question. So I know that the San Diego Food Bank feeds at least least 3,000 kids every weekend right now, um, coming from about 60 different schools in our community. Um, and there, that's probably not even everybody who might need the program. So we're raising funds this entire month. It is Hunger Awareness Month. And uh, we just encourage everybody to donate um, so we can give more backpacks and have more backpacks ready for the kids that need them. All right, don't wander off. I'm coming back to you in a little bit. Okay. Ms. Bunse. Yes. Uh, uh, <laughs> give, give us an idea what's in these uh, backpacks. Yeah, so every weekend, so on the Friday before school ends, our teachers and the counselors at all the schools at about 60 elementary schools throughout the countywide, the kids will receive bags similar to this that have shelf-stable food items and easy to put together and cook for themselves items. So it's items like oatmeal and it's canned tuna cracker sa salad kits like this. So it's easy for our kids to be able to do it if they're with a caretaker over the weekend while mom and dad are working and just making it really easy for them to get the nutrition they need so they're ready to come back to school on Monday to learn. To put one of these deals together, how, how expensive is it? So it's $8 every Friday. So an $8 donation will provide one of these packs to a kid in your local community through our Food for Kids backpack program. But what's really great is they, in addition to these individual packs on every Friday, one Friday out of the month, they also get an additional family pack, which is what you see here down below, um, for the families to enjoy together and cook at home. And it's $300 per kid for the entire school year. School's hard enough. Going, doing school hungry is a whole, an animal that most of us never had to deal with. Exactly. Um, a lot of these kids, um, you know, it's low income families to begin with. So with the high cost of living in the San Diego region, a lot of families are struggling. Yes. And with even food costs, um, it's all adding up and we're so grateful to have our partnership with Mission Fed because they're helping to get out the information about this program to the community and hopefully encourage donations to keep our program running for years to come. All right, so that's kind of why we're here. It's uh, $8, not cheap. I mean, he's got to, so it's going to take some money. Is this a grassroots deal or are you looking for corporate money? Oh, gosh, no. Well, or we're, all, any money. A, anybody, <laughs> the whole community, right? So um, all of our branches right now throughout the county fundraise throughout this month and our members, our employees, everybody is so behind this every year. We kind of call it the most wonderful time of the year at Mission Fed because we just love this program and we know how many of our members are passionate about it as well. I'll give you one story. Sure, one of our please. contact center members received a call and received a very generous donation from someone who said that he had wished that this program was available when he was a child. And that's just so impactful. I think we, you know, right. Stephanie and I talk about just being parents ourselves and mothers. You just can't fathom not be a kiddo not being able to eat over the weekend. And so, right. and any amount that eight dollars is what the food bank has to you know put, what they need to be able to put this together but any amount really matters that and, you can and, give. and just last question and maybe uh, how do you identify which kids qualify yeah so we really rely on the support of the counselors and the administrators and teachers at each individual individual school to identify what kids might need this program the most and what they look for so they don't come right out and ask right it's looking for right. the subtle cues so if a kid's coming to Got school it. on monday you know with stomach aches and it's a consistent challenge that the child is facing which is also from what we're told from them is also an indicator of certain behavioral challenges that sometimes students can face because we know how we feel when we feel right. hungry right absolutely it's hard to focus it's hard hard to kind of engage with other people. And so we really rely on them to identify 
all the kids that will need this program. And we're so happy that this program, since its humble beginnings, grew from 60 kids to now 3,000. And we're hoping to even add more in the coming years. So, Ladies, it's an honor to stand between you. Thank Stephanie you. Bunce, Courtney Pendleton, <laughs> thank, you, thank you for coming in. Thank you for the display. We wish you lots of money raised. Yeah,